It's Kill. And we live on Kill Em TV. Shout out to you first and foremost. I appreciate y'all for tuning in, man. I see y'all. Shout out to all the new subscribers, man. Keep tuning in. It's only going to keep getting better. We're going to keep delivering this raw content, man. But let's get right into it. Bill Collector. Let me holler at you, boy. You just exposed the whole battle rap. You just exposed it, man. Everything that Kaz been saying, everything the real BRC been saying, you just confirmed that single-handedly on your own. But shout out to you. Let's get into it, right? So you said, boy asked you, would you battle, would you be interested in battling Cash? You said Cash is nobody, you know, he's not a staple in battle rap. You know, he just a, a old he's he, he just an old name. He's just an old boy with a name. That's what you said, right? And he trying to uh, you know, not let his name die out. But you know, that's all. The only reason why you were battling is for the look. All right. And then you go on to say it would be too easy. Like, you, would, you wouldn't even really write for him because you could get up there and say one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, and the crowd would go crazy. You just said that. That's what we've been saying all this time. It's watered down and it's corny. You said that when you in a battle with somebody and you see that the crowd is ass, you said instead of you spitting your fire rounds that you had while you watching your opponent go hard and they sweating and they trying to wrap their heart out and the crowd is not reacting, that's when you said you come with your one fish, two fish, and the crowd goes crazy. You, you said this, Bill, not me. You know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm just like, I'm just in agreement with you. Like, this is what y'all dudes be doing. And that y'all consider this winning the battle because of the crowd. So you telling me that forget your fire, forget your three fire rounds that you had in the in the in the clip forget that you saying you going to freestyle some one fish two fish you know i got a gun that'll hit you from mars and all this extra stuff you said you want to um be reduced to that because the crowd is ass forget the viewers that's going to see this on the on the online and you know, the people that's going to eventually see it on YouTube. Forget all of that. The crowd is whack. So you're going to be whack too. Let me enlighten you, Bill. Then you went on to say, hold on, before I get to that, let me get to this. Bill Collector goes on to say that he don't even... First he said... He contradicted himself crazy in this interview. First, he said, "You know, man, battle rappers, we put a lot of we put a lot of time into this, man. You know, we 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 really be prepping, right?" Then he goes on to say, "Well, I don't really start rapping. I mean, writing until like the week of the battle because you know I got a lot of stuff going on." He said he married, he got kids. You know, he be having a lot of stuff going on, but whole time. He thinks of ideas of what he wants to say And then, you know, during that last week or so Or a couple days before the battle That's when he really starts writing and rehearsing And really preparing for the battle So is it me or do that sound a little crazy? Like one minute you saying, yo, man, battle rap Like we really do a lot of prepping Like, you know what I'm saying? Like you done had three, three, four months However long it is before the battle and now you're telling me that you start really preparing for the battle a week ahead, a couple of days before the battle. It makes sense why you do a whole lot of freestyling. But nonetheless, 
however you choose to prepare is on you. You feel me? Long as you you uh get the people what they want, I guess that's all that really matters. But people like me, I don't want one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. That's not gonna cut it. That ain't gonna get it, Bill. And as far as you and battling cast, come on, man, who you fooling? You you ain't known to have bars like that. You know what I mean? I give you that, your little antics and all of that. I mean, that's what you good at. You're a funny bull. But ain't nothing funny about these bars. So that's why you can get away with it where, you know, a crowd might be ass and whoever you battling might really be rapping to you. But you come with some old one fish, two fish and, you know, the crowd go crazy. Perfect example, Goods takes off his jacket. Y'all want the y'all want the y'all want the drunk henny goods or the or the or the sober Tay Rock good like I don't even like I, I don't know man but this is like literally wrestling you know what I'm saying Macho Man Randy Savage Hulk Hogan ripped his shirt off type stuff like that's what y'all done turned this whole battle rap thing into but y'all hate on somebody like Cass for trying to bring it back to the essence. But I want to thank you, Bill, for um for exposing what's going on in battle rap. You know, you help you you really did us a solid, man. You helping out the culture by doing that. I don't know if you know that or not, but I'm telling you, you know, you serving as a big help by speaking the truth. So shout out to you, shout out to everybody tuning in. You know, we ain't gonna spend too much time on this. I want I want y'all to go crazy in the comments though, man. I really wanna go crazy. Cause this boy done lost his marbles, man. He and one minute he's saying this and another minute he's saying that. You sound crazy, Bill. But I'ma help you out with this video right here. You know what I mean? It's killing Castellano. Recognize. <laughs> but shout out to everybody tuning in. Make sure y'all like, comment, share, subscribe, all that good stuff, man. Hit that notification bell. Um, you know, follow me at 215K Castellano. Follow Killem TV at Real Killem TV on IG and Twitter. Uh, yeah, man. Salute to you. Shout out to the real BRC. Make sure y'all log on to the real BRC.com. Y'all ain't got them tickets. October 6th is going down. Go ahead and get that pay per view. You feel me? We're gonna have a fight party. If you in the city, man, at least come out. South Street gonna be lit. Uh, and yeah, man, I'm gonna get at y'all. You hear me? I'm off this joint.